One of the other interesting things that I'm able to do, and anyone can do, is knives or letter openers. And here's a variety of letter openers, some made from construction wood, some made from tree branches. Uh, you can even make, take a toothpick, cut it in half, and make a crocodile dundee hunting knife out of half a toothpick. Uh, that's a good thing to do in slow restaurants, you know, so you don't get bored or get impatient. You can, this is a knife blank, this would be a knife. You can make big knives like this, or very, very small knives. Uh, they're not meant for cutting steak or skinning deer or anything like that, but they will open letters. And uh, this, this case has some. There's another case over here that will show you that has knives made from the reconstruction from Superstorm Sandy. Uh, they were rebuilding some of those massive houses that got destroyed by Hurricane Sandy and there was some wood left in the dumpsters and I asked the construction workers if I could have some and they made some really cool knives out of uh, wood from, uh, from Superstorm Sandy. Right here in the front I have a bunch of little knives like little hunting knives, crocodile dundee knives. Uh, I'm never bored in a restaurant as long as I have toothpicks because I can take a toothpick, cut it in half and make a detailed hunting knife out of half a toothpick and then a flower petal stem and leaf out of the other half. There is a knife made out of half a toothpick. And here's another little knife.